Hey guys, it's Freeze, and I just want to say, what's up? We are playing some MW3. You, you see, I have not played this at all on this profile. I used to have an old one, but yeah, I don't anymore. Uh, yeah. So I'm doing a Q&A part two. Actually, I'm gonna end a party real quick so no one tries to screw up our conversation. Most of my friends know if I'm recording. Be polite. I know it's anything dickish. Elimination. Okay. Um. Okay. I know one of you asked. I don't remember your name, but I remember your question. I do plan on playing other games in Call of Duty. Um, I'm supposed to be playing some Spleef and a few other Minecraft stuff with some friends. But that's not a positive. What the? Uh, way too high. Capture the objectives. Okay, that's better. I was trick shotting last night, which is why I just suddenly wanted to play this. Freaks. I don't want to set the up too high, and now it's all like... Okay, go on, drone. Get package on the way. Dang it. But I'm, um, yes. Security. I plan on playing a lot of other games. I actually want to do a Let's Play series. I would love to make it huge. Yeah. Friendly airstrike on the way. Um... But I am not sure if I want to play or not play. I still have to decide on that. I would actually like your guys' feedback and opinions. I do work a lot, so I do have a decent amount of money. If there's a certain game that you all just agree that I should play, um, I'll try to. I'll probably put in the money and go buy for you guys. Other than that, right now I'm thinking it's going to be like Wolfenstein or something along those lines. Wolfenstein. Oh crap. Um. Wolfenstein, I'm thinking about doing a concert for that for a day. Just show you guys that game. Because I, I love the game. I, I love my Nintendo 64. It's enjoyable. It's different than what most people would play nowadays just because it is an old game. It's a very old game. Yeah. It doesn't have super realistic third dimensional anything. It's it's old. It glitches. But it's a I like to call it like comfy game, one of those games that no matter how bad of a mood you're in how raging you are at the moment a. you can go play it and leave happy how funny would it be if you actually hit that Losing C. yeah I used to be a Call of Duty pro Heads up. Spotted. nah I'm not Wait, let's go for the silent shot. Boom! That was not a headshot. I really should be hitting these. Eh, five and seven, that's not bad because you're gonna play the game. Yes, uh, question two will be. Bad after I get in the corner. I think I have like nine actually this time. Because you guys blew up the comment sections. I am so thankful for. Alright, I'm gonna start with you, Mr. Bot. What was the most dangerous thing I've ever done? Honestly, riding on a motorcycle, or riding a motorcycle for the first time. I am not the most coordinated, but I, I'm been told I'm pretty decent on it by my principals, which one of them has been riding since he was, well, forever. He's a really good rider. He worked at Harley Davis for a while, so. Yeah, there's that. 
I got no patches or anything. I used to have this thing filled with all sniper crap, but psh. all I want is to get that gun. That's it. That is my favorite sniper probably of Call of Duty history. I used to do great with it. I had that gun golden and I loved it. That's the only gun I used to use. Yeah, you guys might just share my phone. Um, but yeah, probably ride a motorcycle just because with that, if I mess up or if I mess up or someone else, this is stupid. It's fun, but it is dangerous. It is actually a serious thing. Because you cannot swerve on a mo motorcycle too much. Turning is... You can't just jerk to the side real quick like a car. It actually takes more to turn. No matter on what speed you're going. Because if you try to turn too quickly, you're going to flip it and kill yourself anyways. So it's... That would probably be the most dangerous. My favorite game outside of COD. Um... I have a few favorites, like I have a childhood favorite, was Pokemon. I still own it, it's um, the yellow version. I probably played it 40, 50 times through. Favorite game when I was child. But nowadays, my favorite game to play other than COD. <sighs> I enjoy a lot of my games. But I'm not sure which one I'd call my favorite. I guess it would have to either be Wolfenstein, because that's a great game. Battlefield. Or... Yeah, I think that's about it. So I, just, I love those games. I can play them anytime and have fun on them. Wolfenstein, I played the... I actually... It has more than just, it's not just a game to me, it actually has a special meaning, because me and my, my stepdad used to play the original version, so, and he was, he thought it was kind of cool that they were making it, and it used to be his favorite game, so I bought that game just so I could play Wolfenstein with him, so that is my favorite game other than COD, because not only is it a awesome game, 5 out of 5, Five stars out of five stars rating. It actually has an emotional tie for me, which makes the game even better. Cause me and my stepdad, we get along most of the time, but he can be hard-headed. I can be hard-headed. He can ground me. I can get my mom pissed at him. So yeah, we have to work together a lot. It was, our lives really suck. Cause my mom really is the only one with power in our house. We let that happen, but it really makes it hard to get away with crap. Like I back him up, but I don't. I don't rat him out. He does the same for me. <coughs> All right, that was by Tara, and then okay, next host migration bill. What is your dream in life? Well, my dream in life is... My main goal in life, dream in life, whatever you want to call it. I'm assuming that's what kind of what you mean. Um, is I would like to eventually get married, find someone who I love. Just be able to get married, have fun, and... I want to actually become a pharmacist. Because I love chemistry and how chemicals react with each other. It interests me. It actually is very cool to me. As lame as that might sound. But then also I want to be able to help people out. So I want to be a pharmacist. Um, I will. I hope to get to a point where I'm well off enough that my wife can do whatever she would like to do like to be able to get two kids I would actually like to be able to still do YouTube but then also have a social life when I'm older but that's wishful thinking 
but that is my dream life to be able to be a pharmacist, have fun, and just do everything and anything I want to do. I'm gonna make sure this no, one second be real quick. He was just having a heart attack. Let's go and see it down here in the trash real quick. Make sure I can see. All right, question four by you or yo. Will I ever meet someone from Xbox? Well, that's iffy because I actually do know Gur. I do know my friend Sniper Panic. We actually all live in the same area. We talk. I know a few of my other friends on my on Xbox. But if you mean like one of the subscribers or just another one of my friends, um, well, one of my friends is NRG Ego. Um, me and Gur, since we live close to each other, are actually really close. We are going to, once we both get fully grown up and get to the point where we're both making enough money, we are going to make probably either, we'll make a trip to, we'll actually go see EO so we can um, meet EO and his family and then he's also going to eventually, hopefully, come visit us and meet our families. So we can all, so we can see each other and we'll try to do that if we as we get older. We'll try to hang out still. Hopefully once or twice a year. We'll meet up. But that's not our promise. But other than that, um, I, I'm actually, hopefully, I want to create a team, not only for, like, actual, like, playing here. I'm trying to find people in my local area that we're gonna try making a MLG team. I have a few people who also would like to not, if not, just go see Anaheim, try to go participate in it. And I, I do know some pretty decent people, even if I'm not one of the players, I would still love to see my friends go play because that is a big accomplishment, I feel like there. But yes, I would love to at any point meet anyone who knows of me, has ever heard of me, or anything else I would love to meet. Honestly, if you live in the Illinois area and you would like to meet me, send me a message personally on Xbox or something, and maybe it'll work out. All right, next set of questions. Check around the corner. Oh, I almost had that. Oh well. I'm just gonna sit down. Alright, actually, there's just two more. Um, favorite moment on Xbox? Oof. It either has to be one of Ego's singing times, because those make me happy. Oh, wow, my aunt, ups, my aunt woke up downstairs. Yeah. Well, that in one of my videos. Okay, no. That's my fault, actually. I, I was... Getting the comments off of the YouTube real quick and Wow, that was bad. Throw UAV online. That would have been cool. Wow. Yeah, you see on these this game, I really don't care about Katie whatsoever. <laughs> it's like Katie. Oh well. I will get to. You're probably tired of seeing me die. Um, who's your best friend on Xbox? Wait, I didn't answer the Xbox moment, did I? Um, it honestly, my favorite moment would have to be probably the first time I got a Kim shirt. Just cause I it was 
or not Kim Strike, um, Moab, whatever you want to call it. I think it was here on MW3, it was a Moab. I was on a sniping rampage on Domination, and I got it. And it really did make me happy. Wow, my name's gonna split the feed on this game. I can't feed on this game. That sucks. Securing Charlie. Securing A. Enemy advanced UAV spotted. Uh, I messed up if it wasn't for that flash. Yeah, six seconds. Okay. Yeah, my favorite moment would have to be the first time I got a Moab just because it was cool for me. It was back when I didn't even, you know, try. Like, to me, Call of Duty, I just screwed around. I didn't really know KD. I didn't even really know how to create a class too well. It was back when I sniped so badly it wasn't funny. Like my average was like 10 in like 30, which is about what I'm doing right now in this game. But I'm okay with that. Like it was back when I heard Prestige and I was like, wait, what's a Prestige? And I was still new. So it was cool for me to go to the Moab. On like it wasn't affected. It was a domination map. That was my favorite. My best friend on Xbox. Eo is probably one of the most important and one of my best friends on Xbox. We don't always play a bunch, but I know if I need something, I can literally I can message him. I can Skype him. I can. I can message him and he'll sit there and he'll talk to me if I'm in a bad mood or something happened. He'll be there for me every day of the week. And I know that. So I'm probably going to say he's my best friend on Xbox. I do have a lot of good friends. A lot of you guys will never actually meet or see in a game with me. Just guys like Target, or Target, Hawkeye, or. Um, Creed. I play like Creed's an awesome guy. I'm not the best at Extinction. Him and his buddies uh, had me play a game of Extinction with them. And to be polite, since I had not played the map before, it was uh, the one with the gargoyles. Um, they gave me the arc thing to help me out. Well, oh wow, I just missed that final kill game. I just lost that final kill game. I suck. But I'm um, doing flights and I did not really know how to play it correctly. Well, they went ahead and gave me some of the stronger stuff just to help me out. Which was very kind of them. But my best friend is Ego, without a doubt. Because I was he I'm there for him, he's there for me. And he's one of those guys that you know that it's not only when you're in trouble that'll be there. If you just want to talk to talk because you're bored, he'll be there. Because he is a good guy. I don't want to make you guys think I like love Ego. He's my friend. But I'm not gay for him. Except on Tuesdays. But, um, yeah. Thanks, guys. It was awesome talking to you. I am sorry this video is so freaking long. Feel free to skip it, watch it in parts. I know I've done that before for super long videos of people I want to watch. I'll like watch like a fourth of it or half of it and then I'll go watch.